Well, we're back again, and um, joining me from Winnipeg is the Commish. Hello, everybody. Well, we uh, this week we're going to debate um, if Major League Baseball should expand their replay. And um, I'm going to say that they should. And in a brief second, uh, the Commish will give his uh, his rundown on why they shouldn't. For me, it, this is a pretty easy easy question. I think when we've seen replay being used, you know, in other sports, hockey this year, we've seen a couple goals, either should have been goals or shouldn't have been goals, and it, it was it could have been the difference between losing a series or not losing a series. I think we've seen the same in the NFL. Is it a touchdown? Isn't it a touchdown? Uh, it, especially in the playoffs. Uh, you know, I think it's important in the regular season, but especially in the playoffs, you've got to get it right. And we know Major League Baseball's got it wrong. Um, we know that um, they started to review home runs versus foul balls because of um, a Yankees twin series where umpires missed some calls. Um, but they don't want to expand it further. And I, I just want to take you back to one event, and I'll let you get in on here, Kamish. Um, if you remember, Jim Joyce, an umpire, Major League Baseball, he missed a call at first base, and uh, Galarraga could have had a perfect game. You know, that, that's just an example of where history was not made the right way. Um, had they had replay and had he gone back, it would have prevented a lot of embarrassment for the umpire who's generally a good umpire and Major League Baseball, and they're blowing it by not expanding it. And I'll let you have a word in here if you want. Play, play ball! That's right. I'm here to play ball. I want to keep baseball traditional. I don't want to be like you and – have a, a game that right now takes on average two hours and 51 minutes, take even longer. How many games do you actually sit down and watch from beginning to end? Me? Yeah. Um, you know, I'm, I have to admit, um, I'm more of a playoff guy in baseball. Well, there you go. Um, unless so. it's the Twins, if it's the Minnesota Twins, and um, I will, I'll watch a complete game. Um, not, maybe not this year because they suck. But, but you know, I just – you make a good point about keeping the game traditional. I, I, I agree. I, I don't think players should wear helmets. Um, I think the goalie shouldn't wear helmets, and she should, he should be beamed in the puck. Because you know that was the way. Oh, this is the same thing as traditional. As, 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 you want to keep it traditional. I think that they should put center ice line back and have offside. You know, you can't have these breakout breakaways. That's traditional. Um, you know, I think when when the guy's going for a puck on an icing, and he should be boarded and. and, and and, and paralyzed, you know, these are the, these are what makes the game traditional. But I think as you modernize, you can make the game more interesting, exciting, and fair. And that's all I'm trying to get at. There, that's what I say to you. You're out of bounds. You're out of line. I don't even know where you're going with this argument. Thank you. <laughs> I, the fact, I, fact is, the fact is that I was looking for. Any kind, some some kind of evidence to support the need for uh, more rinse and replay. And I found one article in Sports Illustrated. There was they talked about the 12 worst blown calls in, in Major League history. And you know what? Whether or not you had replay for all those would have uh, would have just would have changed the the history, the course of history for the game. And I don't think it's necessary. I think baseball is one of the, is the last game that can be left in its purest form, and to start tinkering with it, what are they going to have instant replay for? If you're out at first base? Out of first base, is it an out or not? Then is it going to be, then it's going to be a walk to second base. Are you out of the field or really challenge challenges are you going to give them? It, the game's going to take five you, hours. No, because you don't have so many calls. We see that in sports. You don't have so many calls. That, that they can review. You have certain, you know, every once in a while you have a call, did, did the outfielder trap the ball? Did he catch it? You, you know, you're talking about games that could be at the bottom of the ninth inning and, and something like that happens and that's the difference between a winner or a loss. And we saw that in the Yankees twin series where they did lose a game. It, it was, and that's why they went to having the home run versus a foul ball replay. So they did change the tradition of baseball. The problem is Bud Selig is old school and you know, he can't take it a step further. He's a fuddy duddy and should be he should be out of the game. He's too old for it right now. He's he's too old school. Modernized game means that the fans want a fair outcome. 
it, it's worse for the history. It's worse for the playbooks to have games. Like a guy who missed a perfect game as an example. It ruined the record book, okay, of Major League Baseball. How much better could it be that they got the call right and a guy had a perfect game? That would have been great. We all know he really had a perfect game, but it's not in the record books. And I think fans were angry. They were trying to say baseball should go that way. And, they, and they're not listening to the fans. They're listening to some old school guys. I think you're just a little bit outside on this one. I think you're looking for technology to take over the game. And if they institute instant replay, the, the, the fact is what happens to those ones, that, those other blown calls, and how are those players going to feel? You know what? You keep things the way they are. Nobody gets upset. Leave it to the people that are trained. The, the other thing that I did actually read in another article that made sense to me is you can't. it's not like having instant replay in football or hockey where you have the same – Every stadium is basically the same. You'll have the same view from no matter where you are, whichever arena, whichever stadium. You're going to have the same view of the goal line or the out of, bound, out of bound. In baseball, each stadium is an individual stadium with its own uh, quirks and its own, uh, you know, own, and it's built their own in its own way. So you know what? I, I, it's going to be hard to have the same angle in each, in each stadium. With modern technology, I disagree with you. That's with modern technology. No, I, I disagree. You don't think – I think that they could get it done. I mean, you, you look at – As the, always, I'm right and you're wrong. So the fact is you are looking for technology to take over the world, and yes, it has taken over our world no matter what you're doing these days. I like to see baseball left alone, left as it is. They made one little change, so the home run calls are, are going to be fine. But to go any further is just ruining the game, and it's going to extend it. It's going to be I, a longer game. It's going to lead people. I understand that you're you're old school and and you're you're in the dark. I mean, the, the comment about <laughs> how would how would how would previous people feel about their records or not getting it done? You know, it, that it's just complete garbage because. In the NHL, they never used to review a goal or not a goal. So we know that in the past there were goals that stood or didn't stand, and those are in the record book either way. But baseball is about statistics. And not every arena is the same, by the way. But they figured a way to get that camera in the net. Okay? That's that's easy to get the camera in the net, but it's getting the camera's position in each so you have the same view. You know, I I disagree. I I think they could get it done. I really do. I, I'm not surprised I, you disagree. I think they could. I mean, especially with multiple camera angles and that. I mean, um, we, we know that they're still able to televise these games in, in different uh, stadiums, right? We, we know that they know how to We're get not talking about televising. We're talking about actually finding a uh, finding the, the proper angle for each. And each know, get multiple angles to call. I mean, you know if a, guy, if it's an, oh. if a guy is safe at first or he's not safe at first. Um I mean, these these are easy calls. They 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 found a way to be able to tell. I'm just people. restating what actual umpires who are uh, who should well, be consulted insane. on. This. No umpire in any sport has probably ever agreed that they should have instant replay because it takes away from their calls, right? Um, they they want to be the ones that make the calls, and if you have instant replay, they're saying, well, well, they're going to question what I do on the ice, what I do on the field. You know, that's why they, they're going to come out and say they don't agree with it. And I think that they probably did with the NFL. The NFL officials probably said the same thing. NHL officials probably said the same thing. And what I'm saying is they're complete garbage. It's garbage. Instant replay is better for the game. It's it's better to know the outcome, to have the right outcome than some hodgepodge. And I'm, I'll just leave it at that because then I'm going to get too worked up as usual. You know, I was relatively calm stating my opinions early, but as always, you always seem to get me riled up. Well, you're too easy to get riled up, and I guess. Well, have a good say, have a good weekend. All, all I can say is, take your base. <laughs> to everybody in America, we hope that you have a great Memorial Day weekend, and I hope that you do take some time um, to remember um, those fall, fallen heroes from our country who gave their lives up to uh, to make this a free country. And I also hope that you can uh, have some time with your family and, and really enjoy it as they are important. Um, we will see you next week. Hey, Kamesh, have a good one, okay? Good night and God bless.